Is this a drop or is this just a you know pause in the rally? And what's behind it? Hi, Francine. So there are a few things behind it, and of course. It Bitcoin has been stuck in this mostly low 60,000s range for a while. So it's not a huge breakout at this point. But we had a couple things. We had the infrastructure bill pass in the US, which did have some crypto tax provisions that made the market a little nervous. And so some trading around that of people trying to buy the dip and then some leverage uh, may have made the market a little fragile. And then we had China coming out and warning state firms about crypto mining, saying that they need to get out of it. It's considering imposing punitive measures um, in the near term. So it's you know, that really did unnerve the market. And we had a pretty big drop. So it, crypto is definitely, you know, at the lows for the past two or three weeks. So uh, Joanna, what kind of longer term implications will actually all of these factors have? Yeah, it's a little bit hard to say because China at this point, is, so many firms have gotten out of China. Many of the miners have gotten out. So if it is true that these big state-owned enterprises are doing any crypto mining and this has an impact, that that would be pretty interesting. But a lot of places have gotten out. So China is not what it once was in terms of a factor. So we'll have to see if it does cause any longer-term issues. But still crypto bulls are talking about that 100,000 level for the end of the year. So it, they're pretty undaunted by it. But it, it does mean some choppiness in the near term, probably. Joanna, this is probably the most difficult question I'm asking all day. What's the near term outlook for crypto prices? Yeah, so it is, it, it is likely to be somewhat choppy here. And of course, crypto is quite volatile. It can go down just as easily as it can go up. It's, it, you know, it's easy to see a drop of 10%, 20%. So actually, these drops are not all that uh, severe relatively. You know, they happen every few weeks. But again, the, the bulls are saying 100,000. There is the round number level of 60,000 on Bitcoin. It's just a little bit above that now. We have resistance around 65,000. So we, we could see some, it, we're likely to see some choppiness. But also, the fourth quarter does tend to be good for Bitcoin. We have seen a lot of bigger holders continuing to buy. So the market could be underpinned for the next few weeks at least.